We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. So, let's see how good my handwriting is. Neil. Uh, oh, I'm running out of room. Why is my name so long? Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Neil and welcome to Power Wash Simulator. I know this is kind of a weird game for the channel, but uh, it looked like a lot of fun and I wanted to show you guys this because it looks like one of the most satisfying gaming experiences you could possibly have. Power watching. I know it's a job, uh, but it's, it's one of those things that's just really satisfying and really fun to do, but now we can do it in video game form. Uh, so thank you to the devs for sending me a code for this, but let's get into this. Uh, with the career mode, I guess there's also you can you can clean the Mars rover on the surface of Mars Not sure how that's gonna work out. We'll have to try that But for now, let's just start with the uh, the career mode here and it looks like we're gonna be cleaning a van So what do we got great news finally found a van for you at the auctions? Uh, under your budget. Don't freak out when you see it It looks like it's just been dredged from the bottom of a lake, but that's a good thing uh, it meant no one else bid on it. They missed out because underneath the hideous layer of gunk uh, is your perfect workhorse. Engine's a dream, no rust. There's even equipment in the back. Uh, just needs a good hosing down and you're in business. All right, so we're cleaning our van so that we can uh, hopefully do more jobs with our uh, power washing equipment, I guess. So anyway, let's get into this, shall we? Alrighty, so here it is, and this thing is absolutely filthy. <laughs> Look at that, though. Hey, there we go, so it works! Oh, yeah, so what does it say? Power Wash Services, that's our, uh, our brand, I guess. Was this thing at the bottom of the lake? It looks like it, uh, definitely was somewhere not pretty. Maybe it survived the apocalypse or something. I'm not really sure. Alrighty, so we have a lot of work to do here. Let's go ahead and clean off the windows first. See how beautiful this thing really is. So, the way this works, you have different nozzles here, uh, which is basically how big the stream is. If you go into zero, it's gonna be a very small stream, but it's gonna get all the gunk. You might have noticed uh, that when I had it on a 25 degree nozzle, it wasn't quite getting all the grime. It's more of just like a, if you need a wide area kind of washed down very fast, that's the way you're gonna do it. But when those little spots that are super stubborn, you gotta get out the small nozzle like that and it just wipes them right away. That is, I don't know why, man, that's just, <laughs> it's deeply, deeply satisfying. Like sometimes I'll just sit on YouTube and watch videos of people uh, power washing stuff for hours on end. Sometimes they go to sleep. I don't know why. It, it does help, though. It does help. I think. Let's see if we can try maybe the 15. Is this still going to get all... Okay, so yeah, you got to know which ones to use. This one, at least if you're up close, seems to be doing the job, but there still is some tough stains. Mud, poop. I'm not really sure what this is all over the windows, and we can also see where we're missing spots. Uh, with the tab button. Uh, how is this not clean? What am I missing here? There we go. Okay, so that's two windows down. Let's go ahead and get this one. Sure, why not? Boom! There's all the windows. That's, I mean, I know we still have a ton to do. Look at that, by the way. Look how blue this thing actually is. Hold on. Let's get like a... A nice cover of water here just to see. Hey, you know, that's actually not doing a terrible job at cleaning. Of course, there is some, like, caked on mud that we're going to have to pay special attention to. But I guess the closer you get, which, I mean, it makes sense. The closer you get, the more it's going to clean. So, you know, I might just do a once over of the entire thing and then see what we missed afterwards. And come back in with the uh, the zero degree nozzle and clean things up. Sound like a plan? Can I draw a smiley face? Hold on. And then do this. <laughs> yes. Hold on. Do I have any areas where I can like write my name? Hold on. Hold on. We're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. So, let's see how good my handwriting is. Neil. 
Uh, oh, I'm running out of room. Why is my name so long? Eh, there we go. Neological. Nice. It works. You got to make sure to get under there. Like, really get under there. Because there is dirt covering the tires as well. Because, of course, there is. There we go. There we go. This is starting to look pretty good. I mean, de we're definitely going to have to get in there with the uh, the zero degree. But for now, I mean, honestly, this is doing a pretty good job. Look at the difference, man. <laughs> Seriously, it looks like it made it through the apocalypse or something, this van. But apparently, it's in pretty good shape underneath all this gunk. What game or gunk? Really? <laughs> Woo. All right, we're going to have to wipe away the neological here, unfortunately. Yeah, it was nice while it lasted. Let's get the logo cleaned up. There's bird poop all over this thing, by the way. At least I assume, I'm assuming that's what the white stuff is. Don't forget about the roof. This is where actually, honestly, most of the, the grossness is coming from. This is absolutely filthy. My God, and it's not coming off very easily uh, either. We're going to have to go over this uh, a couple times at least. So I went ahead and finished the roof because I don't want to have to climb up here again. It feels like I'm going to slip and uh, bust my keister. But now we can go back with the, uh, the more fine brush, I guess you could call it, and get all these hard spots, hard to clean spots. And then I think we are pretty much done here and we will have a brand spanking new, pretty much new to us, power washing van. You even got to make sure to get like under the, uh, the tires here. There's still, yeah, there would be mud there too, so it makes sense. But yeah, we got to really get into into the tight spots here if you want that 100%. We are pretty close though, 91%. I forgot to clean these windows. Oops. Let's go ahead and get that out of the way real quick. Come on. Yeah, where's the... Oh, there's still some right here. I didn't even see that, man. That dude was not kidding. This thing is basically immaculate under all the mud. Now, I still have a few spots. They're kind of scattered. Oh, I forgot. You got to clean these, of course. The mirrors. Where's the other one? There it is. Make sure those are tip-top shape. We're at 98%. We're getting very close. Now, what am I missing here? The lights. Of course, the lights. There we go. And let's get the license plate bumper as well, because I'm sure that's still pretty gnarly. There we go. We got some tire on the mud. This thing is looking pretty darn good. 99%. Is it going to give us the 100%? Come on now. How am I supposed to get... Okay. Shoot a beam like right... Actually, you know, we should probably go for the zero degree nozzle here. Like, really shoot it. Under there. There we go. Into the grill as well. And up in here. Come on. Just give me, give me the 100%. Where is it? Okay, grill's clean. What else am I missing here? Nothing on the front of the... Oh, there we go. What? Still no 100%. What am I missing, man? Is it just like one of the random... Oh, it's the something on the body. There's dirt here somewhere. But where? There we go. There you are. And... Oh, it's still 99%. Did I miss something? Oh, yes. The handle. There we go. Still... What? I, I, on the top, maybe? I, I, I'm literally not seeing any dirt. I think I can actually look in here. Yeah. So the uh, brake light. Oh, okay. Okay. So which one, though? Which brake light? Oh, right there. I would have never saw that. There we go, though. 100%. Now. Oh, yeah. It even shows like a time lapse. Hey. <laughs> That's so cool, man. That's so freaking cool that the time lapse. So that was 150 bucks to clean our own van. I, I mean, I, I don't know. I don't get it. But 
Let's move on here. Uh, we can either clean the back garden or I kind of want to try. Can I do this? Clean the Mars rover is going to let me do this. It's time to put the water on Mars to good use as the rover needs to uh, clean. Oh, man. I bet that thing's filthy, too. Let's do it. All righty. So there's the little drone thing. Is this the new rover or an older one? And I have a lot of questions. What, why and how are we here? Um, can I shoot it? Dang it. You can't shoot it. Yeah, so they sent me to Mars. The first person ever to land on Mars was a, a guy to clean the, the rover. Not sure that makes a lot of sense to me, but we're not going to worry about it, okay? We're not going to worry about it. Let's do another once over here uh, with the 40-degree nozzle. Just give it the once over. Oh, yeah, this thing is filthy, man. Filthy, absolutely filthy. I mean, there's winds constantly on Mars, blowing dust everywhere. I thought that was an alien. <laughs> uh, you would think it really wouldn't be worth it to clean it like this. Because it's just going to be like this again in 10 minutes or whatever. But, you know, I'm not going to argue. It is what it is. We're just going to make our way through and, and, and clean it the best we can, okay? It's actually chrome. Who would have thought? Look at that. We're going to shine it up like a, a new $100 million billion dollar penny, whatever this thing costs. IRL, I know it's a lot of money for sure. <laughs> Gotta be a lot of money. But uh, there we go. It's 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 not looking bad. It's not looking bad. There's definitely some grime in there, though, that we're going to have to get to. And cleaning, like, up on here. Oh, I can just climb on the rover. I'm sure there's no sensitive equipment or anything that we have to worry about. But, yeah, we're making short work of this, man. Already 30% done. But it's the details that are gonna kill us for sure. That's gonna that's gonna take a while. I'm I, I, I'm positive on that because there's so many nooks and crannies on this thing. Oh, it's gonna be a nightmare. But we're gonna work through it. And uh, I better get paid millions of dollars. I'm gonna be a hero when I get home. First person to to land on Mars and power wash the rover. <laughs> Again, not sure about the lore on that one, but uh, it, it's a video game. So, you know, it makes sense. I'd like to see, uh, can we get one on the moon as well with like zero G's? That would be cool as well. You know, it's kind of creepy just being out here by myself alone on Mars. We, we, we didn't send a team for this, you know, <laughs> You think that would be a good idea, but nope, it's just me by myself. Let's get under the undercarriage here. Gotta make sure that's clean. Really, I feel like we, this is like the most important part. The camera is like, is what you really want to focus on, right? I mean, that took like two seconds to clean. <laughs> but you know, again, whatever. I'm not going to argue with the story as long as I'm being handsomely paid. I don't care. So yeah, it looks clean, right? Well, I knew this one was gonna take forever because <laughs> there's so many little spots to clean. I mean, look at this. Look at this. This is gonna take this is gonna take a while, guys. Oh my god. We are almost 75% done though, so you know the, the end is in sight. But yeah, there's so so many little things we have to clean here. <coughs> Getting behind the wheels is kind of difficult as well. You got to like have a precise aim like this. Let's see if we can get away with a little bit bigger of a stream here. I think it's working. Yeah, it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. Again, it's going to get dirty in like 10 minutes. But you know what? I don't care. I'm still going to do a good job. Dang it. I might do some exploring touristy type things as well while I'm here. But uh, for now, let's let's finish on getting this done. This one's been taking a while, guys. This is gonna be a long one, for sure. How do I get? Is that dirt or is that a reflection? I can't even tell. Oh, we just got like a huge combo of stuff. Clean. Hey, there we go. There we go. We're almost to ninety percent. Yes. Keep it up. Yeah. I'm starting. It's starting to get hard to see the actual dirt now. And the red sky, the red tint isn't helping. Okay, this is still dirty. 
There we go, right there. Still very satisfying. What are you looking at, man? I'll shoot you right out of the sky, dude. This is gonna suck. All right, so this tire is still dirty. What am I missing? It's like right in there. Oh, right up top. I see you. I will eliminate you. And there's still some right here as well. Come on. Let's clean it. Still in there. Why is this one being so stubborn? I don't know. There we go. Finally. Still not to 90%. Oh, wait. There's more. There we go. 89%. What am I missing here? What am I missing? Maybe, maybe I'll go up top again. Hold up. Oh, this sucks. This sucks. It's going to take forever. Something underneath, maybe? We're going to have to check the details here. Um. Oh, wait. It says everything's clean. So I'm missing the hatch and the wheel hubs. One of the wheel hubs isn't, isn't clean yet. Which one is it, though? See, now I'm just kind of... I'm spraying everything, trying to find... And I don't understand because it says wheel hubs five of six, but they're all clean. They're all clean. So I don't know. Watch here. I'll prove it to you. Wheel hub clean. There's no wheel hub here. Is there? Am I missing? Maybe I'm missing something here. Hold on. No, there's no, there's no dirt. There's no dirt. Anyway, this one clean. This one clean. Can't clean anymore. This one clean. This one clean. Is there another wheel somewhere that I'm, I'm missing here? <laughs> really, I'm, I'm confused. I'm confused now. And also, apparently, there's something called a hatch. Well, where's the hatch? Oh, wait a second. Wait a second, guys. I think I saw dirt in here. There's a little bit of dirt in there. There's a little bit of dirt in there. Hold up. Where is it? Where is it? I saw you in there. Where's the dirt? There it is. Still at 89%, huh? <laughs> uh, I, I don't know where a hatch is. Is it this thing? Do I have to clean this? That would be evil. But no, I mean, that's not doing anything. Is there something like off in the distance or something? Everything else is clean. This is 11% of it. So it's gotta be like a big spot, right? I feel like I'm being trolled right now. When you push the tab, it's supposed to show dirt spots. I see no dirt spots. <laughs> There's none. So where's the freaking hatch? It's got to be a big, big thing, right? I'm really looking here. Okay, guys. I, I knew this was, it was going to be something like this. I had to literally, I cheated and I'm sorry, but I had to look this up. The hatch is not part of the, the actual rover. It's over in the desert somewhere. <laughs> there it is. Oh my God. And what are you doing here, man? So there was an extra piece. Literally spent like 10 minutes looking for this freaking hatch. And there's green goo. There's something weird going on here, but we found it. We found it. So really, I think all we got to do now is clean this hunk of junk. And then we're good. What is this, by the way? Is this like part of the lander or something? Or is it aliens? We got a green gnome. I'm f I feel like it's probably aliens. Oh, wait. What is this now? Are those the tracks that this thing makes? Or is that me? Did I? Am I an alien? Did I land? <laughs> what the heck? I, I I think I think I might be an alien power washer because it leads right to oh wait no there's a second set yeah okay they lead back okay whatever it's an alien apparently that's what we're gonna go with guys I am an alien power washer and I was hired by NASA to clean this thing because I was passing by that's what we're going with I guess there we go it's clean it's clean! Finally! <laughs> Good God, that took forever, like a half hour to clean this freaking thing. But there we go, sparkly and new. How much are we getting paid for this? I don't know, there's the uh, the the breakdown here. Cleaning that thing. <laughs> there we go, finally did it. Uh, are we, do, do we not get paid for that one? I don't think we do. Since it's not on the campaign, dang it! Well, it was fun anyway. 
Anyway, guys, I think that's going to do it for this episode of Power Wash Simulator. If you guys want to see more of this on the channel, let me know down below in the comments. I'd kind of like to keep playing it. There's actually quite a bit to the uh, story mode, and uh, we're really just getting started. I only did one mission in the campaign, but uh, that one with the Rambars Rover took forever. It was worth it, though. It was satisfying. Uh, anyway, guys, that's going to do it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to hit that like button down below and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will talk to you guys in the next one. See ya.